Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I thought I would do an update on my Jaws collection. I have already done a vlog on the collection, but I've added some pieces since then. I was going to wait till some pre-order bits have come, but I've always, I'm always waiting for some Jaws bits, so there's never going to be a right time. So I thought today's the day, as I've got room to put it all out before I box it up and put it into storage for a little bit, I thought I'd share some with you, some of my favourite pieces. So if we sat here, this is the beach towel from Primark. These were really, really, really hard to get. Um, I ended up getting this one from Liverpool. But super glad I got it. And if we come over here, this Funkoverse strategy game, that's new. Um, we are going to do a vlog on us playing it, but it says before you play it, you need to watch a video on YouTube. Um, yeah, so that's what we need to do there. This is new to the collection. The Life magazine did a Jaws 45th anniversary special. So I'm glad I got that. That was, I think I got that in the UK because getting it from America is going to cost quite a lot. Uh, my Jaws game, love that, found that on eBay and it is like new inside. There is a bit of writing on the box, um, but apart from that the box is in really good condition, the game's in good condition. I have done an unboxing of this, so I might do um, a Jaws playlist and it'll be in there. The Jaws game, that's really hard isn't it? hard that in it to play so we haven't actually played that right but hey uh, and I'm starting to read this the, the Joe Alves designing Joe's book that is really good it's got some great pictures inside Put that there I don't know if I'll be able to show that falling over so he's the one that designed Bruce and it's just got some brilliant pictures inside so worth getting is that I have the oh the magnets from the Jaws ride at Universal when I went years ago so I'm super glad I got them at the time because that is no longer there in the Florida one this Christmas stocking was done by my friend it was made by Hoos from Dis Dutch absolutely love it comes out every year still out now from Christmas this is the book on the Joe's ride from the Florida ride that one that's really good basket with the original Joe's book not the first edition because they're quite a few pennies uh, this is from Universal Studios Japan a little towel love that and then these little bits here that you can see these are from this Jaws box it's the Amity Island Summer of 75 kit there is an unboxing of that as well on our YouTube channel and it comes with like little vouchers for Amity Island little magazine bits and bobs and then this awesome towel which you can't see but I'll show you in a minute I'll show you properly properly yeah properly, properly. Uh, I've just finished reading this this is so good this is by Carl Gottlieb who is in Jaws and it, he actually helped write part of it and it tells you some tales from Amity Island so yep well worth it bargain got this from Wilco's just after Christmas was it a quid yeah. yeah a pound for that I did want to get the other one but for some reason didn't pick one up because I just didn't because I'm stupid but hey I'll find it my sister made me this for Christmas which is awesome it's got a bit of everything on if you know you know and then I've also got I set up with this one. This is the 40th anniversary coin, and it has a mother of pearl guitar pick. Yep, yeah. yeah. picking it. Plectrum. 
I'll show you the coin because these coins are gorgeous. Well, I'll show you if I can open the box. She opened it. Opened it. <laughs> <laughs> so. <laughs> so I'll show you both sides. These are so well made. And they're quite heavy as well. So that was for the 40th anniversary. And that comes in a little box with a certificate. And put that there. Then the next one was this one. This was the Jaws of Bruce. So this is the other coin that they brought out. These are so well made, I love them. So this is the latest one that they've brought out. This is for the 45th anniversary. So this is the latest one they've brought out. I've kept this in the packaging. And it's even got the little shooting star absolutely love this one and then because I think I ordered it so early I got a little bonus present which is ace poker chip that's from Wilco's bargain I think was that two quid bargain okay there's H&M um, Bad Hat Harry, I think it's called, on Instagram. Uh, gave me the heads up on these, so ordered them. Those are cool. My friend so kindly gave me this. So if you're watching Paul, thank you. Absolutely love it. Uh, also, this is quite new, what I got. I uh, got this off eBay. I can't remember how much it cost, it wasn't that much actually. I think um, we got a bit of a bargain. But yeah, it was originally 55p and it is in mint condition. And it still has the poster inside. Okay, let's move on a bit more, shall we? This was a limited edition book, Memories from Martha's Vineyard. You can still get this book, but This one is a special one because you get, not only do you get a um, DVD of some extra bits of Jaws behind the scenes, but it also comes with a piece of the orca, the sinking orca, because it was two, oh, limited to a thousand, this one. So that is precious. This was still book of Jaws. There is a new one out. It's got like um, a Japanese cover on it but I don't know. I'd, it's £25 so if anyone wants to buy me it, thanks. <laughs> we just haven't got the cash at the minute because we're decorating. That's why I can actually get all the Jaws stuff out to show you. Thinking Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. This was a present of my sister. This is from uh, I'll put the name at the bottom, just under the, the Bruce, because it's got a right funny name. But that is from there, and these are amazing. They do all sorts, they do um, three foot ones, and they do just the fins, or you know, whichever. So he actually came on offer with a little tank. So that's with him. And then I also ordered separate from the same company as the bust I ordered a barrel and of course Alex's little Lilo get your kids yeah <laughs> then got this um, last year haven't got a 4k player but when I do I can watch Jaws so yeah got this from HMV um, this is just the normal Blu-ray but it's got quite a funky little cover. Meep, meep. <laughs> Cute. So this is new, this is a pennant and I got this off 
eBay. So sweet. And then this little beauty. Baz got me this for Christmas, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, th I think this is from actual Universal site and it's limited. I can't remember how many. But it is so cool. I think you can buy it. Where's... I've seen it in a couple of places you can buy it online. But yeah, love that. Okay. Joe's soundtrack. You've got two. Baz bought me that. Little Joe's print. Love it. Some beach clothes sign tape thing. Um, now these reaction figures, these used to be cheap. Baz bought me this one. I bought one for my sister. Went to buy the other two guys and the figures are just a horrendous price. So if anyone's got a spare Brody or Hooper that they want to sell me cheap, thanks very much. Greatly appreciated. <laughs> it's worth a try. <laughs> worth a try. Now this is quite new. I bought this from Aldi for, what say, 5 dollars I think you were about 3 dollars I'm sure it's 5 dollars but if you look on our Instagram, I put it on there. So if you don't follow us on Instagram, maybe you should. Uh, now this little, I'm going to try to get the light right. That print there, that was from a Comic Con, Horror Con, whichever con. Horror One of them. Love it. And I love this. This is what Baz got me. You know, focus. You know, you know. Yep. So this was for, was it the Commodore 64, this one? It was on it. Absolutely love it. So I used to have a Commodore, well, my sister had a Commodore 64 when we were little. And we used to play on it. And I just mentioned it to him one day. I was like, oh, I don't really like that. And he went and bought me it. So if, you, if you're too young to remember tapes, you could load this tape, go and have your tea, have your Sunday night bath, probably go for a walk, and it might have loaded by then. Yeah. Or the tape stopped. But you had to turn your telly down because it had the most annoying yeah. in the world. <laughs> I love that. And these are quite, I got these recently, Joe's 3D glasses, just because they are awesome. That's another eBay purchase. Another present off Baz, little orca pin. Do you recognise the cardboard? If you know, you know. And this is a picture signed by Susan Backline. She was absolutely adorable. I could have kept her quite easily. And then you have the pop vinyls. I still need Bruce with Quint and Bruce with the tank. So that's on my wish list. This is a, let me get this down. Another purchase from Baz, Jaws VHS. I used to have this as well. And for some reason I got rid of it. But I wasn't actually collecting Joe's and it's just sort of, all this has grown. Just really without me knowing. And then there we have the postcard from Universal Studios and also some of the flowing presses. Can you see that? And then moving to the left we have the Hendrix um, graphic novel and that was signed and it also came with a limited edition print we got that just before Christmas as well and then up here uh, this VHS light box was from Baz the uh, Joe's print that was from a number when was, oh that was, was it from a Comic Con it was one I can't remember which one that's from a Comic Con so was this I love that one this Joe's like box, this is another present from Hoos and Mike. Love them. And they come in, both of these came in the original VHS box. That box is from Baz's, I do have that one, but it's in storage somewhere. Bruce the plush is from Universal. And then this little butte is from Paul McPhee, who I'm sure lives on Martha's Vineyard. 
and he does paintings and sells them and look at it, I've got this one, this is signed, I've got another two of his, which I will show you in a moment. This is my other Paul McPhee picture and I also got some stickers given, can you see that? These are from a um, Jaws Fest thing that they do on the island and they must have had some left over because I got that given. Another Jaws picture from uh, a Comic Con. If you go to Comic Cons, you should always check out the drawings because you find some really nice stuff. Yeah. And as always, you have to have the Jaws movie poster. And then this one is from Jaws Fest. This is also signed by Paul McPhee because he's the one that designed it and painted the original. So yeah. Also for Christmas, these aren't like official Jaws merchandise. But I got a little Jaws ruler. It's cute. A little pencil sharpener. A grow your own shark. Some little pencils an eraser and a little cute pencil case how cute is that so sweet oh it's glittery red hello so that is my collection i'm sure i've missed some bits out i'll think of them probably later when it's too late but i just thought i'd share the updates with you of what i have and i do have some like i said some bits on pre-order but could be waiting ages for them so i'll have the chance i got all this out to show you and it's not the biggest collection but it's mine and if you do want to start collecting just start collecting and you find some bargains here and there so yeah thanks for watching please give it a like thumbs up share comment all that goodness follow us on instagram and yeah see you later